hello my lovely people i hope you are all doing great in today's video i'm going to show you how to upgrade your windows 7 to windows 10 without losing any data and any application all that you need is an internet connection and a reasonable amount of free storage space on your c drive at least 20 gigabytes also please check on my desktop you can see some of my personal data and applications that have been installed so without wasting time let's begin first open your browser and type download windows 10 iso and press enter here choose the first link that says download windows 10 disk image on this page you will not find the download options so what you have to do is to click on these three dots then go to more tools then again click developers tools again come to another three dots here and go to more tools then network condition Here, untick this, use browser defaults. Then click on the drop down menu, then choose Chrome OS. After reload the page, and you can close the developer's window. Now, scroll down. You can see the download options. Choose Windows 10 Multi Edition, then click Confirm. Again, choose your product language and click confirm again now choose your bit version either 32 or 64 after that the download will begin this will take some time so please be patient because the file size is about 5 to 6 gigabytes so whilst downloading you can open another tab and search for wind cd emu and press enter Choose the first link that says download. Again click on the green download button. After the download is completed, you can click on it and open its folder. Now right click on Wind CD emu file and run as an administrator. Then yes. Then check the box that says customize installation option. Then also tick require administrator rights to mount image. Then after click install, then install again. After you see installation complete and click on OK. Now right click on the Windows ISO file and click select drive letter and mount image. Then yes, here on this window don't click anything, just click OK. Here sometimes you need to minimize these two windows and go to your desktop in case the setup.exe does not appear here. So I will minimize these two windows. And yes, it appears on the desktop. Then click run setup.exe. Then click on yes. Now you see this box loading. After completed, another window shows up that says install windows 10. Here, tick the box here and click next. After, wait patiently for your computer to check for these updates. Here, accept the license terms. Again, you see another window that says ready to install. And you see check marks for install Windows 10 and keep personal files and app. So here click install and wait for the process to complete. After that you can see Windows 7 is upgraded to Windows 10. You can also see all my files, data and softwares are intact. So that brings us to the end of today's tutorial. If you find value from this, please kindly give me a thumbs up and subscribe for more amazing tutorials. Thanks for watching, have a good evening and I will see you in the next one.